I have with me today, I have with me today, <laughs> Dr. Keenan. And Dr. Keenan, it's good to be with you this morning. It's so wonderful to be here with you too, John. Yeah. Tell me what's going on in your life now. Maybe we should start with the doctoring stuff. <laughs> <laughs> sure. From the doctoring standpoint, uh, well, I've been still working at the hospital in the emergency department, yeah. you know, seeing my patients. And this past fall and winter, I've started doing some consultations and some groups in uh, nutrition and weight loss. Mm. So that's been really fun and exciting for me. So I do programs uh, at Dr. Sheree's Sh clinic, you know, the naturopath in yes, Douglas Town. Yes, yes, she helped me tremendously. Yeah. So we have, um, you know, I think that really for health, when we can work together as part of groups and communities, you know, where people can share, it makes such a difference. And remember, John, when you and I started the Daniel Plan in Blackville, yes, right? Yes. So, you know, the Daniel Plan, the focus, faith, food, fitness, focus, and yeah. friends. Yeah. And so, you know, we tried to run that and had our turnouts, but then I kind of expanded that into a 12-week program. And so... Really? I've been running it. Is it so your own program or pieces and things you pick up from other people, of course? And yeah, things that I pick up, you know, and, uh, and I try to incorporate, uh, really it is the principles of the Daniel Plan, but other things that I've read, also a lot of what research shows makes a difference in people's lives. Right. You're and not just, I hate to say just a doctor, <coughs> but you're also a nutritionist, aren't you? Or That's you, right. You're training in nutrition. Yeah, that was my undergrad when I went to McGill. Yeah. So I did nutrition, and part of the reason I did nutrition is I always wanted to have a backup in case med school didn't work out. Really? Yeah. But also, I just wanted to know how to help people from, you know, a prevention standpoint. Right. And I think it really has gone a long way in shaping my career, because, John, I've been out now, like, almost 20 years. <laughs> You're still so young. You must have started when you were 12. <laughs> it's actually wonderful. Um, so, yeah, so really, I think it was always underlying what I wanted to do was food, you know. Yes. And so when I work with the groups, you know, I really, and with weight loss, because I've tried one-on-one, -on -one, and so many people, you know it, they try one-on-one -on -one to lose weight. And it's so hard. Yes. Because it's just you against yourself. Thus we have the church. <laughs> That's where faith comes in, exactly. right? Yeah. When we gather together, really. Yeah. We were never made to do anything alone, mm -hmm. were we? We're mm -hmm. supposed to work together on everything we do. And we only need where two or three are gathered. That's the truth. Yeah. That's so the now truth. I have 10 to 12. Yeah. But that's what Jesus started with. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder if that's why, like they always say when you're working with groups, yeah. so 8 to 12 seems to be this magic number. Right. That come together with a group. Yes. Yeah. I think there was 11 then when the church started. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, we'll stay off my subject. <laughs> I guess it's your subject too, isn't it? Yeah. 